The National Museum of Patriotism was a museum in Atlanta, Georgia, at its peak occupying a 10,000-square-foot site on Spring Street in Midtown Atlanta. However it closed in 2010 and moved to an online-only presence. The founder of the museum was Nicholas Snyder, a retired UPS executive. History It was founded by Nicholas D. Snyder, a former vice president of United Parcel Service. It was located in Atlanta, Georgia, opening in premises at 1405 Spring Street on July 4, 2004, and in 2007 moving to a site at 275 Baker Street, in the Centennial Olympic Park near the Georgia Aquarium and the world of Coca-Cola. Jim Balster was the museum's first executive director, followed by Jim Stapleton, and then Pat Stansberry. In April 2009, the Patriotism in Entertainment and Music exhibit was opened in a ceremony attended by Kenny Gamble and Patti LaBelle. At the same time, the museum inaugurated its Patriot Award, recipients including LaBelle and Gamble, Lee Greenwood, Cowboy Crush, the Bob Hope Foundation, and Access Hollywood. Closure In July 2010, the museum was forced to close. The museum rebranded itself as the National Foundation of Patriotism and planned a revolutionary online virtual museum. The museum auctioned off some of its exhibits and artifacts. 